Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with some uh, oxygen not included. The uh, dude uh, fixed my base series. Uh, that was probably a pretty bad dude, but I've been getting some complaints about my dude. Anyway, uh, this base comes from uh, MH uh, Kaisers. Hopefully, I'm pronouncing that correctly. And his main issues. I'm going to pause right here because we're going to run out of food. His main issues were. Um, Surprisingly not, well I guess food was one, resources was another, and just generally making it through the mid game. So I found uh, quite a few things that we can improve upon here. I'll quickly run through them and that's uh, the wiring. We've got heavy watt wire throughout the whole base, uh, which is bad for decor, so we're going to try to fix that. We've got some uh, serious slime lung issues, which doesn't really, it just slows the dupes down now. It used to kill them and now it just kind of they get sick, they get slow, uh, and then they have to kind of recover. Um, we're going to try to clean that up. Uh, we've got germy water down here that's going into the food supply, which is causing them to get sick. And if we look at the food here, the little bit of food we have, it's actually full of germs. We've got, uh, let's see if we can click on here. We've got, we've got uh, some raw egg in here. There's some mush fry that's got food poisoning, and I think there was some more rotten food in here. No, maybe not. Maybe they ate it. Uh, what else do we got? We got we're missing a great hall. So if we look at the room overlay, this could, this mess hall could be a great hall, and we could be getting a bit more morale out of it, which will help. Uh, the schedule is kind of messed up. We've got uh, downtime here, uh, which is kind of spread out, which will cause them to do some work and then come back and relax and do some work and come back and relax. So we'll try to fix that by making the downtime contiguous. What else do we got? We got, uh, like I mentioned decor, but decor in the base is absolutely awful because of that heavy watt wire just kind of crowding everything out. Um, we got some, uh, we got a natural gas guys are really close to the base here and we've got uh, manual airlocks, which is kind of working, but we could try to do a liquid lock here instead to try to make sure no natural gas gets out. Liquid locks are actually pretty quick to set up. And then finally, let's zoom out a bit here. Um, I would say that uh, they're not really exploring quickly enough. That would be another thing. And before we get started here, I'm going to op change the options here. We are going to change the autosave to like never. Just to. We probably wouldn't get much lag here. Okay, so, oh, the other thing is priorities. I noticed a lot of priority nines, which generally are okay for some things, but I think I'm going to scale that back. We're going to do eights on oxygen and filters. Uh, food we can do is eights. Whenever we see a nine, we're going to make it an eight and then use nine for just emergencies. In fact, all of this could probably be seven. Okay, let's, wherever we say, we'll do seven. And we'll, we can ramp things up if they go bad. Okay, that's that. Uh, I'm gonna cancel any kind of build orders that are going on. Except for this is fine. Uh, that's probably good. I think, I, I have a feeling we've got some stuff in storage here. We've got everything in storage here. I'm going to actually kick everything out of storage. Which will cause a big mess on the floor, but we'll we'll clean it back up pretty soon. And then I did notice this. We are feeding actual food to these critters, which is really, really bad. Probably only want to feed um, rocks to hatches. So we'll do... We could probably do dirt, but let's just do for now. Let's do... Sandstone, sedimentary rock. Because we really shouldn't be feeding really good food to them. We should feed that to our dupes first. Okay, so that's probably good. We can also op open some doors here. That's not really critical. But I like to open all the doors because it, it speeds them up a little bit. As they run around. So we'll do that. Real quick here, let's fix the schedule first. 
I'm going to keep it at slow speed here until we get things kind of sorted. Oh yeah, the priorities too. we got lots of kind of specialized priorities here. I think what I'm going to do here is just reset the priorities to defaults. And we'll come back and we'll fix that. Kind of fine-tune it in the future. But for now, we want to go with defaults. Okay, we got a... I think maybe a, we'll do a great hall first. We could... We can make this into a great hall and this into a great hall. So let's just do some digging here. We're going to clean this up a bit. Maybe I'll speed things up here. Open some doors. Just to make... Oh, this door shouldn't be open. <laughs> we don't want the hatches to get out. In fact, I there's a couple... Oh, this is a hatch farm here. Let's make, let's make that closed, actually. Oh, actually, this is a Dreco farm? I don't even know what this is. This is like a miscellaneous. Oh, we got slime in here. Why are we feeding slime to these guys? Okay. Let's, uh, let's reset this as well. I'm not even sure if this is supposed to be a Dreco farm. I think it's supposed to be a hatch farm. Let's turn this cooler up here off. So much to do. So little time. I think I'll cancel that for now. Open this up. We'll just kind of play it as we go along here. Gotta get the food up, first of all. Otherwise they're gonna have some issues. The food actual tending, we could make that a seven because food is important. And we don't need two different farm stations in here. I'm gonna remove one of them. That one is good enough. Okay, it looks like we got slime and polluted dirt every, over here. That's probably the cause of all the slime lung. So if you store things underwater, it forces the uh, the gas to not come off. So priority nine, we're gonna put a few storage containers in here. Maybe four. And I'm gonna put slime and polluted dirt in here. And we could put a compost in here as well with a hand washing station to try to make sure they don't touch that. Uh, this algae terrarium, I'll probably get rid of that. This airlock we'll get rid of. Now, we don't want them making food out of this disgusting water, so I'm going to remove this water pitcher pump. And we'll have to put a floor in there for the, allow them to get around again. And then maybe we'll let them use some water over here. Or there's a little bit of water at the bottom here we could use. This has no germs in it. So we'll, we'll let them suck up that water. We'll put our pitcher pump down here. And we really need deodorizers to be kind of working away here. There's so much nasty air. They're all getting sick with slime lung. Nasty stuff. We probably need more ventilation as well. But let's just spam some deodorizers in here. We got nasty air everywhere. Okay, so polluted dirt and slime. We're going to stick that down here. Polluted dirt, slime, rot piles, all the nasty stuff we're going to stick down in here. And really they shouldn't be touching this stuff, but I'm going to get it all underwater first. We don't have any outhouses anymore, so that's good. There's no poop going anywhere. Uh, we'll put the food priority nine. That's one thing I like to keep priority nine. Oh wow, everyone's everyone is sick. We also need some decor in here, but first we got to fix the heavy watt wire. I'll stick a deodorizer in there too. Why not? Oh, there's some mushrooms in here. We should probably get on the mushrooms pretty soon too. It's a pretty good food source. Make sure these deodorizers are priority seven. And we got one, two. We got multiple smart batteries, and we don't really need them all, so I'm gonna get rid of one, two, three. We'll leave one of them. That's all we need. Got a nice little power room down here. That's good. 
Let's make sure our power's still hooked up. We don't even need this extra battery down here. Oh, I'll, I'll leave two. One, one is good enough, but we'll leave two. And the automation looks pretty good. Don't need this anymore, so we'll get rid of all that. And we got some pretty good temperatures down here to grow mushrooms, so I might put a little mushroom farm in down here. Okay, it looks like we got lots of polluted crap over here. We'll slowly uh, be putting that stuff away underwater, and that way it won't it won't be doing this. It won't be bubbling all this crap away. So I think I'll actually do some high priority sweeping here. Priority nine. We're gonna get whatever's on these two tiles here, and grab that. We'll grab what we can, and then we'll put some minerals in here. Let's see, raw mineral. Make that raw mineral. Low priority. They can they can get to it when they get to it. These doors are not really doing anything for us. We'll just get rid of those so they can get around faster. This guy we'll get rid of. Food shortage. Okay. Let's uh We're gonna make some food. We got hatches here. Let's grab some of those hatches and eat them up. And I will put the food back to priority 9 because we are running low. Probably don't have a big enough food area for the number of dupes we have. This is it, I think. That plus a few hatches here and there. Not the best. Let's make sure we're cooking up everything we need to cook up. Mushroom, uh, omelets ever, forever, mushrooms forever, barbecue forever, frost bun forever. We'll just do everything forever here. That's good. Okay, they can't get to this puffed. It's gonna take a while to recover from some of the issues here, but we'll get there. Some of these airlocks we can get rid of. How's that slime going? We're cleaning it up. We're cleaning it up slowly, but we'll get there. Put some more over here. Probably want to clean up the air in here too. This is where the food drops, so let's clean that up. And the wiring. I kind of want to fix the wiring. So, let's see here. I think I might do like a little transformer room down here. So we'll do like a little mini floor down here for transformers. I think power is the number one issue I see people getting problems with. Mixing heavy watt wire with regular wire, using heavy wire in the base. Yeah, I see that kind of stuff pretty frequently in these fixer-upper base series. I was going to fix the schedule, so we'll do that. Let's make um, all the downtime right before bedtime. I will give them four blocks of downtime because we're really, we're really kind. We like our dupes. We like them to take it easy. And then the rest we'll get rid of here. So, four. This way they won't be running back to the base all the time. And then we got bathroom break, bathroom break. Oh, this, this downtime we're going to do right before bed. Or that. Uh, I think we can get away with one bathroom break for everyone. So, one there, one there. Okay, I think we're good. We got four break, one bathroom, three sleep. That should be good. Okay. And non-overlapping bathroom times.
All right, we just gotta let them catch up. Our little dupes. I think I might prop this water up a bit. We'll stick some tiles underneath just to push that water up a little bit. How are we doing on algae? 11 tons, we're good. We'll dig some algae if we need it. Right now we're good. Really gotta get rid of this guy here. Okay, on priorities, I am gonna put combat up to high, just so we get rid of that little puff who's pooping everywhere. And what do we got here? Shine nymph for water. Let's take some clean water. The piping is actually pretty good. Looks good, except we're feeding germy water into the espresso machine, so we're gonna disable that for now. We don't want them drinking poop espresso. Nasty. This battery can go not helping us. Whenever I see a battery, I think wasted electricity, wasted heat. Don't need it. Food shortage. Yeah, we'll, we'll get around that. Eventually. Okay, the food's not getting picked. For some reason. Make it an eight. No one wants to harvest. Are they set to harvest? Let's see. Yep. Yeah. Maybe no one's got harvesting. Let's make farming up. We'll stick it up one priority. Maybe that'll help. We're feeding clay and sand here. I think we'll reset that. And we'll do the same thing we're doing over here. Oops. I think I messed that up. Copy, paste. Okay, so we got some space for the power here. Wow, no one's... Everyone's busy doing stuff. Oh, there's still priority nines here. Oops, let's make those... Two. And we're gonna cancel all that pickup for now. We'll make another set of um, mineral boxes here. There we go. Now they're doing stuff. Besides picking up and putting a bunch of stuff away. Oxygen's a little bit thin over here. Might want to fix that. Okay, so transformers. More than meets the eye. Uh, large transformer. Stick one of those in there. We'll probably need a couple at least. Maybe three. So we gotta bring this heavy watt wire down. We'll probably just do a whatchamacallit here. A power heavy watt joint plate. Right here maybe? Just to cross over. And then that'll connect up here to the top sides of the transformers. Uh oh, suffocating. Oh, false alarm. Everyone's okay. So that'll be one wire coming out this way. That'll go up to the base. I think I'll just lead it around here like that. Probably not priority nine. We'll do eight. Iron. That'll go up to the base like that. And we'll lead it through the floor because it's a little bit cleaner. And then we'll hook up this stuff here with that. Oops. Straight line, please. Yeah. Then we can get rid of this whole heavy wire line here. And then we'll do the same thing up here. We'll have a second circuit for that. And we've got this beautiful cold biome over here that we haven't gotten into so I think I actually will get over there and actually 
break in there because there's lots of good stuff in there. We got snow and ice and wheeze warts probably. Yep. And free food, free delicious food. And lots of chili chili ice which we can melt in the base and that'll be good. I have a feeling we got some priority nine stuff that I'm missing here. Those are eight. It's okay if power is nine. I guess that's all we got going on. I think that's okay. It's priority eight deodorizers. That's a little bit high. Actually, I'll keep algae as eight. We only have 11 dupes, so it's not a whole lot of people working on stuff. Okay, we're going to do a bridge here, even though we don't really need it, because we're going to be removing wire in a second, but we'll stick it in. Stick that in there. Generally a pretty good base. No uh, no big complaints, except for the wiring and the slime lung, which is getting cleared up. Yeah, we're getting there. Stress is pretty low. It was zero when I started. We'll do another. We'll do a great haul over here. Let's do that. Uh, we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Water cooler. Actually, you know what? I'm oh, gonna do every two. Then we can put some art in there. Some beautiful sculpting blocks, maybe. Actually, we need to do some more art research. We're going to go for fine art. Then we can put some nice statues in there. Here we go. We're getting into the ice. We don't really need the cooling yet, but good to get in here. See what there is. Get the free food. We'll set all this food to auto harvest because it's delicious. Such deliciousness. Okay, we got a geyser down here. I don't know what this is, but we'll check it out. We got fire poles. That's good. That'll get them around quickly. This door we can open. Probably get rid of a fridge. Let's get rid of one of the fridges. Oh, everyone's just not happy with their food. Oh, they're happy over here. Okay, how are we doing for power? That is all hooked up. So let's get rid of this line right here. All oh, this can go. This will fix. This can go. Actually. Just realized that's powering everything up top. Hmm. You know what? We'll get rid of it anyway. And we'll kind of... Quickly. We'll quickly do a different circuit. Get these hooked up first. Definitely don't want the toilets to go offline. Okay, that's the research and stuff. Yeah, let's just quickly take all this nasty wire to here. Let's just, just go a little bit nuts here. Oh my gosh, there's so much of it. Okay, we're just going to take it all out. Goodbye. Goodbye, heavy watt wire. It's been nice knowing you. But you gotta go. And we'll get a secondary line up here. Toot sweet. Okay, let's just do this stuff here. That'll be on one circuit or two. 
I think I'm gonna just risk it and go hook all this up here. And up here, yeah, we definitely need the oxygen. This is like a quick, very quick retrofit. Okay, that can go, that can go, that can go. Don't need that just yet. We'll do this as a third circuit probably. Okay, for this, I'm gonna have to do a bridge. Oh, straight lines, please. And another circuit like that. Oh my gosh, if you hold shift, you can draw straight lines, but I don't like using it for some reason. Okay, this is go this is going. This is coming together quickly. I like it. I can go there. This has to go. Hopefully I'm loud enough. I realized when I started recording, all my sound levels were messed up for some reason. I think something got updated and stopped working for some reason. I don't know why, but everything was too quiet and then I had to redo it, but now we're good. Okay, we got no power to the food. That's a bit of an issue. Okay, this is almost done. Just need a bridge. And I think we'll be all connected. Like so. Okay, it's okay if the heavy industry stuff is kind of on its own circuit. That doesn't bother me so much. Okay, we got power back restored on the food. How much power do we got in here? Potential power consumed 1.44. Get this. What about this one? 780. Uh, we gotta get this pump hooked up. I don't know what it's. What is it actually supplying? Oh, this food, kind of, not really, but. Man, we got the portal. Let's grab some hatching eggs. I don't think I'm actually gonna. Oh, we'll power this thing. That's okay. I wasn't gonna... I uh, probably need a third circuit here. Or we could use 2 kilowatt wire for everything, which would probably be better. Oxygen's looking a bit thin because I disconnected everything. I think I'll use this circuit for up top. And we'll re reroute this line here. Emergency retrofits. And I messed up the room here. Oh. Seal that up. Okay, this is going up here. Hook up our top oxygen. What's going on here? I think I messed this up. Hmm. Yeah, we're overloading because that's going straight through. What have I done wrong here? Can we not bridge over that? I think we'll bridge. I think there's a wire through here that I'm missing. Nope. Okay, we're going to do a bridge in a slightly different place because something is messed up there. We're going to do the bridge right here instead. and remove that bridge. So I definitely messed that up. I think that'll work a little bit better. Come on, dupes. You can do it. Probably get some mushrooms planting down here, too. 
I think the temperature is okay. 33 degrees. Yeah, we can probably stick some mushrooms in here. Uh oh. What happened? What did I do? I didn't leave a mesh tile there. Bad, bad, bad. I think I just got polluted water. In my good water. Yep. Uh, Priority 9. Clean up. Aisle 5. Okay, that hopefully fix things up. But did we get germs in the good water down here? Luckily, no. There's a fish in there. Tropical fly fry. Living in our water. Still food shortage. Yeah, let's get these mushrooms going. Where's our nice... There's a nice temperate spot over here. Where else could we put some food? Get some food... Put some food here. We want CO2, though. This area's not really being used for anything. Could put some food in here. It's a good temperature. Stick some mushrooms in there. I guess we'll, this will be really messy, but it should be okay. Why not? That'll work. Stick some food in there. We're not too picky. The CO2 will get stuck in there, because it's kind of like a little U-shape. As long as the CO2 can fall down here. Cancel those over there. And yeah, we'll just stick mushrooms in here. A little bit cooler over here. Probably need some airflow here, so we'll stick a little bit here too. Now, normally I wouldn't use priority 9 for everything, but I want to. Ooh, stress is 56. Giorno. Everyone's got like an interesting name. Oh, wow. Holy moly. Everyone's got a J name. Gerato, Joss, Judy, Jonia, Jordan, Joseph, Jury, Jolson, jo <laughs> Oh my gosh. Someone likes J's. Suffocating. Did I lock them in there? I did. I trapped them. Bravo. Bravo. Way to go. Okay, do we have any mushroom seeds? I hope so. We better. Fungal spore, nine. Good. We shall fungal it up. Get rid of these containers. There they go. Fertilization will set these to priority seven. Food's, food's important. Shave this down a bit. Okay, so we got food growing. That, that'll help things quite a bit. Quite a bit indeed. You can get off the meal lice and... Uh, yeah, maybe extend this mushroom farm a little bit, so we'll carve this out just a little bit more. I think we can get rid of this area here. Free it up for more important stuff. Oh, we got stress creeping up. Okay, one thing I like to do, and I haven't... I missed, to, missed doing it in the last... Time is to add a new schedule just for relaxation. So it's just going to be all downtime. Except for some bathroom and sleep breaks. And then anyone who's really stressed out, like Giorno, Jovena, 
um, we can stick in that schedule. Just don't let them chillax. Our Drekos have escaped. Because I opened the doors. Oops. We'll put them back. Oxygen's looking fine. As long as there's a place for the CO2 to go. Oh, what's going on with the power here? Out of coal? Consumable ore? Coal, eight tons. Oh, we're fine. Let's make the power priority nine all the way across. Yep. And we're done with this area. So let's mop that up. More deodorizers. We still got lots of slime lunk. So deodorizers. Here. Here. Liberal liberal use of the deodorizers. Who's trapped? Oh yeah, you're trapped. Until you get this done. Don't die. Get out of there. And really, this should be a an actual room. We could make it a double-decker room, actually. But I think what I'll do is just stick a door somewhere here. Hmm. Could stick a door up here and then move the ladder over. Okay, we're gonna uproot that one mushroom. This will be our entrance way. Be a little bit Frankenstein of a room. Stick a door there. Kind of thing you can clean up later. And then some tiles here. Make sure it's a room. Yeah, and then we can put a, um, whatchamacallit in here. Let's cancel this and stick a farm station in here to get more food out of this slime that we're adding. And eventually we could extend this to the left. This is kind of in the way right now. Food shortage. Okay, I didn't quite finish my mess hall. Let's do that. I think we got some new furniture now. We got the large sculpting block. We'll make that out of granite because it has good, good stuff that way. And then... Let's do that. that. We can probably house everyone in here. But we'll have two two great halls. We'll put one in here as well. And there's actually no decor in here for, for when they sleep. Which is kind of unfortunate. They could be happier. High stress. Okay. Jorner Jovena. You are not getting any better. Your morale expectations are a bit high. Once we get a great haul, I think we'll be a little bit better here. Okay, let's let's quickly get this going. We'll get plus three morale from doing this. Do we have any paintings? Yeah, we could put a blank cabin canvas in here. Turn this water cooler off.
Gotta fix these blocks here. We don't need them. Okay, let's make sure we have a good artist. Uh, let's see. Do we have an artist? Yeah, we have one here. Not quite a perfect artist. Oh yeah, here we go. Joto Jokid. Let's get an art hat on you. And we're going to make Johto do all the art for us. So under priorities, we'll make decorating. Oops, I just sorted the wrong way. We'll disallow it except for Johto Jokid. We'll make it high priority. That way, he's the only one doing art. How's that slime line? Eee, still got some over here. Snazzy suit, anyone? Maybe Joe Kid could. Or who's stress note the most? Jorno. This you, Jorno. Let's get you in a snazzy suit. We got a lot of stuff on the printer here. Uh. Pip eggs. Where did it go? Did someone put it away? Probably. Let's go find our snazzy suit. Oh, it's right there. We're gonna get Jorno in that. Jorno Jovena. We probably need a massage table too. Okay, how are we doing in this room? We have a great hall. Perfect. Suffocating. It seems like I made things worse, but we'll... You gotta break a few eggs. Make an omelet, right? Okay, soon we'll have two great halls. That'll help the morale a bit. Probably get these wild mushrooms out of here. They're not gonna grow anymore there. This food shortage should go away once this once these mushrooms come online. They are growing slowly. We could probably cram a few more in here. We could do two layers here. We could do probably do another layer here. As long as the CO2 gets stuck in here. Okay, we gotta probably add some wiring here. Maybe here. I'm not really using this exosuit dock just yet. natural gas thing will... Oh, it's going to come on in 2.7 cycles, so we better seal this up. Could do a liquid lock. Kind of like that. Now, would that work? Is that what I wanted? Probably not. Not quite. In fact, we could go through here instead. But we'll do a liquid lock right here.
Okay, do we got two great halls? Great hall, great hall, good. Should help with morale a little bit. How's that decor now? Ooh, better, much better. We just need it in the bedroom now. Let's put some more mushrooms in here. Mm. And that Dreco, where did that Dreco go? We need to put the Dreco back. He's down here. There's a baby down here. Okay, we're gonna go capture that. This Draco. Any other Dracos out there? I'm running around. There's one up here. Get those guys put away. Chronic food shortage. Could put some mealwood over here. Maybe. Temperature's good enough. Okay, anyone want to get these old Dracos? There they go. Oh, they try to get him. How's our coal? We got six tons of coal. That is a little on the low side. LG, eight tons. Get some more here. Might as well crack this open. This little guy over here is... Fart note slime lung. Ugh. Let's get rid of him. Goodbye. Foul beast. We never really went completely in here, so let's do that. Get up there. Get some ladders going. Okay, we'll probably just go straight up this way. Can we go straight through there? Yeah, let's just do priority six, not too crazy. Get access to this whole area. the free food. Go all the way down. That should help with the food a little bit. And we got a anti-entropy thermo nullifier here which we could use for cold oxygen generation eventually. I just realized this pipe here is radiant gas pipe. Which is probably not the re the best pipe to use because this this natural gas is going to be coming out at 150 degrees, which is going to cook the base eventually. So we'd probably want to replace that with insulated pipe instead of radiant. Probably add a bit more airflow here. And we could clean up all this crap on the ground. So I think I'll make some storage just for metal. Metal ore. I'll make a bunch of storage for that. 
and then refined metal. Do a spot for that, a couple of containers for that. All low priority, so they only they only work on this when they're when they're bored out of their minds. We got compost over here, I didn't notice that. That seems to be a decent place to do it, as long as they're washing their hands, which they're not really doing. I'm not really sure what they had planned here. But we are gonna probably undo it and force them to go around here. We'll maybe open this up a bit. Actually, it's not, really, it's not super important right now. Oh, look at this big chunk of algae and coal. I like the look of that. We are going to go up one, two. Start to grab all that. And there's a little bunch of free food and oxygen up here. Don't be afraid to explore, folks. Lots of good stuff out of there. Lots of free stuff. We're gonna go all the way over here. See what's over here. Grab some coal, grab some algae. This little oil section, I think I'm gonna get rid of it. We'll open it right up. After we do some mopping. Do a little bit of strip mining in here. Grab this algae. And this isn't really doing much anymore, so we're gonna mop that up. Deconstruct that. Now eventually we'll have to get off the algae. For now we're okay though, because we got quite a bit of algae sitting around. Okay, how are those germs? Still a little bit trickling here and there. Do need Oh, I never fin finished my liquid lock, and I kind of have to do it pretty soon here. Okay, we'll quickly do that. Right here. One's enough. Do that as a nine. Oh, because we got natural gas coming out. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay, we need an airlock in there first. Just... <laughs> Just... That's an emergency. Forgot I took all that out. We don't want natural gas in the base. No, we don't. Not at all. It's worse than a farter. Come on, Jonia. Okay, that's in there. That'll help. For now, we won't let anyone go in there. Till this liquid lock is in. Calories are still low, but this mushroom crop will come in eventually. Oh, it's coming in already. Good, good, good. And that'll get cooked up. That'll add some calories. Okay, liquid lock. Here we go. We're gonna stick, I guess, water in there. Priority nine, enable auto bottle. Put some fresh, clean water in there. I 
think this will work if there's a tile there. We'll find out pretty soon. Then we can start using this natural gas for the natural gas power plant that's down here. And I'm going to build a floor underneath it that's a little bit lower or higher. Yeah, we'll probably do something like that. And then this will be our little catch basin under here. Just like that. Instead of doing it down here. Okay, this water is running low. This fish is not happy. We could do some temp shift plate out of ice right at the bottom here. That'll get things nice and cool. And if it's touching the water, it'll get it'll get turned into water pretty much instantly. How's morale? Stress is 5%. We can probably fix some scheduling here. We put uh, Jorno on the relaxation schedule. Jorno, you like to be asleep at n or you like to be awake at night. So we'll put Jorno over here. Night Owl. I think that would be okay. Maybe. I think we should take on Night Owls. Okay, also I got some other storage here. We're probably going to put some dirt in here. And other stuff. We got coal we could stick in there. Maybe some dirt in here. Dirt and clay. Oh, something fried. I fried my wire. I'm going to disconnect this. Don't really need that. Don't really need two of these micro mushers either. Get rid of one. Oh, that was the lice loaf one. Okay, we'll do lice loaf in both. Or sorry, both both meals in one thing. Okay, how's our liquid lock? It's coming along. We're waiting for about a thousand kilograms in this tile and then a couple hundred in this tile. We could do a mixed liquid, but I like to just have one liquid. Oh, we have too many toilets, but that's okay. Too many is better than... Actually, we only have three sinks and we have five toilets. This is potentially a bad thing. I'm going to take two toilets away. Actually, we can get rid of four and then put another sink in. That will fix the ratio. That way, if four dupes go to the bathroom at the exact same time, there's four toilet or there's four sinks for them to wash their hands. Open that door. Okay, liquid lock is looking good enough. Turn that off. Now we can safely go in here, hook up some power. Kind of need another power line. I think I'll do another one right along here. I could build a transformer somewhere over here. Put another transformer down. Where should we do it? Maybe over here. Even though they're kind of going around here. A 
where to do it. I will, well, I'll just do it down here. I'm kind of out of space here. So let's do one of these. And one of these. Where are we going with this? Over there. Okay. And I'm over the one hour mark, but we're going to keep going here. Because I kind of want to get things to a state that I'm happy with. Food's better. And these mushrooms will multiply. Once we get a few more seeds out of this, it'll be all good. Make sure we got slime. We got some slime. That's good. Slime should be over here in this container. Yep. Still working on this ladder. I'm gonna make this a bit of a priority here. To get this food out of here. How's the temperature? Oh, uh, it's getting a little bit warm in here. Probably put some put a thing here. Wheeze wart right beside the kitchen. Keep it nice and cool. This fridge is actually filling up. That's a good sign. Allergy medication. Are we actually making? You know what? I'm gonna kick the allergy. I'm gonna kick the medicine out of there. There's probably an apothecary, apothecary out there somewhere that I'm missing. Don't see it though. Let's get this allergy. Oh, we got free muck. Muck up here. Let's harvest this stuff if we can do it. Eventually, we want to get in here, get this free stuff. I'm curious what's over here, so speed that up a bit. Fix our sink. Left only. We could allow them to go in this side as well. As long as it's a one-way door, they can go in this way and go left. So we're gonna put a door right here. Hopefully they don't... Gotta get that in there really quickly. Oh, I can't put a door there? Why not? What's in the way? That's strange. Oh, now it works. Okay, that was weird. Okay, we don't want them... No, you got dirty hands. You go over here. Oh, I think I spread some germs there. Oh, you. Just in case. Wash your hands. Okay, we're gonna make sure this door is only left. To the left. So they can come in this way, but they can't leave. So we're gonna get soon we're gonna get some free power out of this. Got high pressure in there. Just gotta get that wire built. All the other emergencies I've given them. Unreachable dig. All that snow is going to fall down. Get stuck down here. Uh oh. Nasty water. 
Let's make sure all our ice is going somewhere as well. We'll stick some containers right over here for ice. Right in the snow here. It's getting nice and chilly here. Maybe want to insulate this area a little bit. Do an insulated tile, igneous rock right here and here. If we could get in here. Gotta explore this area here. Pips running around. <laughs> That's okay for now. Can they actually get in here? Unreachable build. Did I set this door? Oh, yeah, I gotta open this door up. I gotta allow them to go in there. What's in here? Lockers. Let's get in there. Let's see what we got. Okay, let's rummage. So we'll stick all the ice in here. It should stay cold and frozen. We do have stuff melting here though. I'm gonna put a little stopper here. So if things melt, they uh they don't drool all over here. And we did did have some wheeze warts in here we could be using. So where's it getting warm? Up by the cooker. I was going to put one right in there. Let's make sure we're making frost buns. Yep. Okay, food's looking a lot better now. We got a surplus, that's good. Don't want any of that. Don't really want to puff right now. Still got overloading wire. Took that off. Could probably get away with just one less algae diffuser in there. And this third power line I never fixed, never finished. Just gotta let them build it all. Wrap that priority up, I guess. This airlock, not really doing anything for us. We'll get rid of that. Make a couple of these on nine just to get some water melting down here. It's nice and warm down there. There they go. This should melt right away. They finish it. Poor fish. Done. It takes a while to build these. They're 800 kilograms. Yep. 
Beauty. Nice cold water. Okay, perfect. I have a feeling this could be a little more optimal here. So, so they don't just slide up the pole, which is really slow. Okay, is this reachable? Yep, I'm just busy. Busy doing other stuff. Hanging out, chilling out. Okay, here they go, building the wire. That's what we want. We got chlorine coming out of there, so that's not good. Let's make this dedicated to bleach stone. Don't want that chlorine spilling out. Got some free oxygen in here, which we could tap into later. Probably head in here, get that free food. Oh, there's more down here. It's, it's never ending. Okay, ice is gonna go in here. Liquefiable, ice, polluted ice, snow, and carbon dioxide if we find frozen stuff. Priority six. Okay, this pump is off. Let's put that back on. Okay, they are getting popped eardrums in there, but Okay, so this thing's fired up, ready to go. Free power, kind of. This vent, everything that's not natural gas should be going out. Out of here, like down here maybe. That's kind of ugly, but we'll allow it. And I kind of want to straighten this room out, so I might do... I might push this up here. This will stress them out, but... What are you going to do? i going to stress them out a little bit. And this pipe... 32 degree, yeah, we don't want this anymore. So what we're gonna do, insulated gas pipe, igneous rock, priority seven. We're gonna replace all this pipe here. Just to keep that temperature in there. Should probably run it through the floor as well so it's not as ugly. Same with here. And that CO2 is going to get stuck there, so we might want to send it over to the CO2 scrubber. Which is up here. Otherwise, it's just going to get trapped there. It's probably going to be pretty warm too, so let's use insulated gas pipe. We're going to go... This... Oops, that's not what I want. Insulated gas pipe up this way, and then we'll stick it right there. Uh, 
about the scrubber so it gets scrubbed. Then we'll need a pump down here to grab this polluted water and do something with it. Okay, calories are looking great now. Decor. Mm, could be better. I'll probably build another bedroom and add mo more decor over here or something, maybe? Yeah, we could just extend the base this way. Yeah, we could put a put some rooms up. Oh, not sandstone, though. We want granite. Granite's got more decor. So yeah, we could extend this way. Build a room, a bedroom over here. Make this kind of a little, little corridor. Open this up here. Make another hatch farm down here. You know what? Might as well do that. Can never, never have too many hatches. I think this is supposed to be food, but hatches are food. Yeah, so another bedroom here with more decor. Let's just rough that out. Won't actually build it completely, but let's make it. Uh, these things are three high. Probably not. Kind of like using four high. Granite. Just trying to make things level. Something like that. And then we do bed. Granite. And then statue. Maybe two statues. Bed. Two statues. Bed. Two statues. Bed. Two statues. Bed. Something beautiful like that. Or maybe not so beautiful, but this ladder I would probably retire. Not necessary. And then once this was built, I would put some statues in this bedroom to try to soup up the decor. Because decor makes them really happy, helps them morale. But I think I'm going to wrap things up there. We didn't quite finish off, but I'll probably just keep playing this base for fun, but not record it. Because I kind of enjoy taking these bases and redoing them. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, as always, thanks for watching. And we'll see you all in the next one.